Now to a story the A News Now investigators reported first. A nationwide manhunt for a convicted sex offender ends right here in the Las Vegas Valley. It ended the man's month-long run from a sexual assault charge last month in Utah. A News Now investigator Kyle Payne went to the scene of the arrests. He's here now with more. Kyle. David, Metro arrested a convicted sex offender who's now accused of sexually assaulting a teenage girl. But we must warn you, reports of the incidents leading up to the arrest are alarming. 36-year-old Christopher Law, alias Outlaw, according to Utah's sex offender registry. They also say location unknown until Thursday when U.S. Marshals arrested him in North Las Vegas. This exclusive photo obtained by the 8 News Now investigators shows Law getting cuffed. Now he's at the Clark County Detention Center as a fugitive from another state, Bountiful, Utah to be exact, just north of Salt Lake City. The marshals tell me Law has been on the run for almost a month, getting as far away as Colorado and Sacramento, before he found himself at the end of his run in southern Nevada, at this intersection of Craig and Simmons, where a witness says the police caught up with Law in the street and backed up traffic. Law pleaded guilty in 2010 to aggravated sex abuse of a child, a first-degree felony in Utah, and sentenced to six years to life and made parole. Then last month, court documents showed he's charged with raping a teenage girl he knew. Law telling a witness, quote, he couldn't help himself. The victim telling the witness, quote, we had sex. The document says it happened forcibly while she was asleep. The document says Law asked the witness to wait till 9 p.m. before calling the cops so he could, quote, get things together. He left and another witness called the police immediately, but Law drove off in his Jeep. Christopher Law is due in court on Monday. Uh, here in Las Vegas, early Monday morning. Authorities in Utah want him to stand trial on that June sex assault charge. I asked CCDC if Law would do a jailhouse interview with me, and he declined. David?